Now, from your weather authority, meteorologist Joe Bird. Lots of nice days ahead in the forecast when it comes to sunshine. That's some extra cloud coverage. I mean, we really didn't have that going on for us at all today. So starting tomorrow, we will, but we'll still get sunshine at times. And we're going to stay dry as well. So no rain in the forecast for quite a while. Let's check out those records. Put a quarter in the jukebox, and let's see what it plays for us here on those four records. Oh, only three records, so not, a, not as much music today. Record high back in 2001, so really not that long ago. 70 degrees. That would have been nice to have today, though we were just 18 degrees shy of that today. Uh, so really Really not too terrible there by any means. As for our record low, I will not wish for that to come back anytime soon. 11 degrees back in 19 and 37. Record rainfall just shy of an inch and a half there back in 20 and 11. No record snow, and I'm okay with that. That is for sure. How about your pup walking forecast for tomorrow? See how things are looking here. And as we go throughout the day, I am putting green paws all day long. Get out and enjoy it. I mean, maybe the morning hold off at 9 o'clock, still upper 30s there. But then 40s as it go throughout the rest of the day. But uh, meet Dom here, a uh, pit bull terrier there. Been told fantastic with the kids. 60 pounds, $175 uh, up for adoption, but uh, no fault of his own. I think Dom is uh, eight years old, maybe six. I forget what number it was. Six or eight years old, uh, up for adoption, was surrendered by the owners, but of no fault of Dom's own. It was just the owners just said, we can't take care of the dog. We feel bad doing and having Dom by himself so much there. So uh, give It Takes a Village a call or itvrescue.org uh, to uh, check it out. Nice blue bridge with blue lights on. It. And we got the waning gibbous moon, as you see there. Kind of almost looks like a full moon, doesn't it? But it's not. It's a waning at this time. The next full moon will not be until, I think, uh, after Christmas, right? No, the 29th. Yeah, December 29th is when the next full moon is. You get two weather geeks in here, we can talk moons all night long. So, <laughs> looking good, though, uh, down in Owensboro at this time along the Blue Bridge. Where the current temperature down there is 35 degrees in Smothers Park uh, as we look from our Hampton Inn uh, vantage point at this time. All green as we go into tonight. And check this out here. We'll get the menu to come down. 29 degrees, though, tomorrow morning at 5 o'clock. So, really cold, but not much of a breeze. Uh, but nonetheless, three or more, you do get a wind chill. 35 in Evansville, a north wind there at 6 miles per hour. Hour. 35, uh, as I just told you, of course, in Evansville, uh, 35 in Calhoun, 33 Madisonville, 30 in Greenville, chilly down there in Muhlenberg County at this time, and same thing in White County, 30 degrees over there in Carmine. Nothing to show on the radar. I mean, it's going to be quiet today, tomorrow, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. It's going to start getting a little busy on Friday, looks like right now, by Friday afternoon. Network of Dopplers, nothing going on there. Storm trackers all quiet. I mean, check this out. If you want cloud coverage, you either got to go pretty far north or go down into the deep south where they're getting some cloud coverage down towards Montgomery, Alabama, down towards Panama City, and some rain down in the Gulf. Nothing here at home, as you see there. So as we go through Future Tracker, uh, it's really quiet. I mean, even tomorrow morning, maybe a couple high clouds in the area, picking up a little bit more so as we get into the afternoon. So just a good mix of sun and clouds throughout the afternoon. Uh, Mid-40s tomorrow, could see a couple upper 40s down to our south and east, but overall mid-40s in Evansville. A little cloud coverage tomorrow night, some very clouds. Not a big deal. We're staying dry. Monday, though, a little extra cloud coverage will be in store. A clouds mixing with some sun. Uh, diminishing as we go throughout the afternoon just a little bit. We still stay dry, though, on Monday. No big issues there. Highs mid-40s on Monday and Tuesday. It is looking good as well. Partly sunny skies throughout the day on Tuesday and once again staying dry. So the rain chances are very small for the next several days ahead. As for our Wednesday, double nickels there at 55 degrees, a little breezy, a little warmer on our Thursday. Day. The rain chances again pick up on Friday afternoon, and the 40% you see there, that's mainly confined to early in the day on Saturday. So no snow in my forecast by any means, Noah. It is just going to be rain, and uh, I'm okay with that. I don't like forecasting, so I don't like this stuff. <laughs> we, we've got a good week ahead of us, though, Joe. And for December, 55, 57, we'll take it. Yeah, normal's about 47 right now, so anything above All that, right. I'll take it. Yeah, no, it looks very good, Joe. Yeah. Thanks so much.